There are 52 cards in a standard deck of cards. Suppose six cards are drawn at random from a standard deck. Find the probability that all the cards are hearts. To find this probability, uh, the first thing you have to realize is that there are 13 of each uh, hearts, clubs, spades, and diamonds. So with 13 hearts, that means the probability that the first card is a heart is 13 out of the 52 possible cards. Then the second card, the probability it is a heart, there's 12 hearts left, assuming we picked a heart on the first card, and there are 51 total cards left. And then keep going down for all six cards. Now there's only 11 hearts and only 50 cards left. And then for the fourth card, there's only 10 hearts and 49 cards left. For the fifth card, you got nine hearts and 48 cards left. And finally, for the sixth card, you have eight hearts and only 47 cards left. So multiplying all these probabilities together gets you the probability that all six would be hearts. So that comes out to be about 0 0.00084289. But of course it says round to four decimal places. So our fourth decimal place is zero, but the eight tells us to round up to one. So my answer would be 0 0.0001. Now, for the probability that uh, all the cards are face cards, given that we know that kings, queens, and jacks are considered face cards, well, there's four kings, four queens, and four jacks, meaning there's 12 possible face cards out of 52 total cards for the first card. So there's a 12 out of 52 probability that the first card is a face card. And again, just like in the first part, will go down because now, assuming we've picked a face card, there's only 11 left and 51 cards total. And I'll keep going down the same way that we did with the first part until we consider all six cards. So 9 out of 49, 8 out of 48, and finally for the sixth card, there's seven face cards left out of 47 total cards. And this gives us a probability of 0 .00004 five, three, eight, six, rounding to the fourth decimal place. Looking at the four tells me to keep it uh, zero next to it. So my answer would be 0 0.0000, or you could just get away with writing in zero into this one. So now let's find the probability that all cards are even. Well, you have to consider how many even cards there are. There's a two, a four, a six, an eight, and a 10 that are even cards, and we're considering queens to be 12. So that means <clears throat> there are six total possibilities for even cards. But each of those six, there's four different cards, because there's, for instance, a two of hearts, a two of clubs, a two of diamonds, and a two of spade. So out of the six numbers that are even, each one of those has a four possibilities. So that means there are 24 even cards in the deck out of 52 total possible cards. Now, assuming the first one we picked is even, the second one, uh, there are 23 even cards left and only 51 cards left. And I'll keep going down until I've got all six cards even. 21 out of 49, 20 out of 48, and finally 19 out of 47. Calculating this out gets me 0 0.006611. So rounding to four decimal places, I would have 0 0.0666.